Hello again, welcome back to my channel. I'm Dina, and today, <laughs> in episode 20 of our Super Mystery Dungeon Pokemon playthrough, we're going to try yet again to uh, save our friends <laughs> from the uh, mysterious and pretty difficult dungeon that all of the grown up Pokemon said that we should stay away from. Um, this time, let's see if we have any, like, money or things that we can use. Um, oh yeah, so we do have quite a few items that we can, um, hopefully be able to use this time around. Progress device. Oh, using it enables you to save your adventure in a dungeon. Okay, good to know. So... Let's go ahead and take some of this stuff out. Um, and, uh, yeah, let's just grab all of it, why not? And, what if we have any money in here? Oh, yes, we do have quite a bit of money. So let's, um, that's the max. So let's take out just like that much. And maybe we can buy things? Is this? I think this is what we need. Let's buy... Ooh, yes, Revival Series. Let's get more than one of those, I think. Oops, oh no, it only lets you get one at a time. I see how it is. On Berries, pretty useful. Can I only get one? Yes, it looks like I can only um, and I guess an apple, and then let's put, put some of our money back, and by some I mean all of it. Okay. What do you think? Third time's a charm to rescue myself from this dungeon? <laughs> oh my. Who knew this was going to be a dungeon that spanned so many episodes. <laughs> and then once I do, I guess, save myself, I still have to, uh, you know, beat the dungeon itself. <laughs> Member selection. Let's also go for... Ooh, I don't know if you can hear that, but the kitty cats are taking a lap upstairs. They're running around. How about Chimchar? this time around. Okay, let's go! Not that I didn't like Squirtle. Squirtle's actually like my favorite all-time Pokemon, but maybe the type matchup might be a little bit better with Chimchar. We certainly encountered Spinarak a lot, and oh, there he is, so here we go. And I want to be in control of Chimchar, I think, for now. Chimchar has got Ember, Double Kick, and Fake Out. Oops. Uh, don't, don't do that. How about Ember? Wow, am I poisoned already? Really? Okay, well, looks like we're already gonna be using up a Petula Berry. My, my. Okay. Let's hurry up and get to the next level. Nothing in here. Speed past it. Keep going. Try up this way. Oops. There's a spinner egg. Ember. And try again. Okay. Ah, coughing. Uh, how about fake out? Nice. There's a critical hit. Oh, don't, don't. Ooh, don't you poison us. Eek. No one poisoned. <laughs> I don't want to use up all my petra berries so quickly, but... It might have to happen. Okay, here we go. Oh, man. Well. Ah, oh, spinner egg. Take that. No, no, please don't kill me, please don't kill me, please don't kill me. <gasps> yes. I got an elixir. Um, looks like it's time to use a berry already, I guess. At least it'll um, up my max HP, so that's something. Oh gosh, 
this has been a kind of embarrassing playthrough um, these past few that I've filmed. Ah, there we go, to the next level. Yes, go, go, go. Basement floor two. We got this. Uh oh. Mm. Come on. Uh, oh, I can't use Ember from back there? That's weird. Eek. Uh oh. They're coming at us from all angles. Oh, good job. Oh, yeah, Warren Berry. Eek. Axew. We're coming, Axew. Watch out. Oh, okay. Ooh, but Axew has poison. Ooh. Ooh, got a apple. Okay. Sorry, Axew, but I don't have any more Petra Berries. Ember? Uh-oh. And there's a gloom right behind. Ooh. Mm, come on. Yeah. Good job. Oh, I guess that gloom is not gonna try and attack. Okay. Um. Eek. Yeah, I know. I'm sorry. Axew. I don't have anything for you, buddy. Oh, yes, I do. I have an Oran Berry. Mm. But uh, I guess here you go. Still won't cure him of the poison, but okay. Well, here we go. Nice. Here's the next level. Okay, let's go. Okay, third basement floor. I got a slow trap, and it looks like that's not gonna help. Oh, okay, now I'm at normal speed. That was weird. Um, okay, this is a weird room. There's a lot of different choices. Let's go up first, I guess. Mm, uh oh, two Pokemon in the way. Luckily, Ember should be pretty good against him. He got burned. Nice. I assume that's what that means. Yeah. Still on fire. Okay. There was a Zubat back here, but looks to be gone. And that was just one big loop. Uh oh. Ooh. There's a lot of baddies. Mm, ember? Come on. Uh oh. Ah! Oh no! Ah! Oh no! Run away! Run away! Ah! Uh, all these guys. Oh, maybe I have Cherry heals, heals paralysis. Apple Alliance. Tiny Reviver. Oh, okay. Chesto is going to sleep. Okay. Um, let's see. Gym Chart does need Elixir, so we'll do that. He's still confused. Uh oh. Run away! Okay, that's not bad. Ooh, let's just keep going this way. I'll do this and hopefully leave. That to her. Can you hear me, buddy? Ah, oh, nice. Okay. Whew. Uh oh, ball toy. Let's just go down this way. Sylveon is also needs some healing, but oh, there's a Zubat. Ooh, there are just so many enemies in this. Ember, there we go. Okay, hopefully there will be enough time to heal before other Pokemon come. No. Ooh. Oh, come on, man. Aw, oh, man, I'm poisoned. Ooh. Oh, gosh. <sighs> okay. Ooh. Do I have any... Yeah, nothing. Okay, cool. I'll just walk along this way. Uh. Ooh, 
here's the next level at least. Basement floor four. Basement floor four. Ooh, did that cure me of poison? Nice. Okay. That's good at least. Um run around a little bit and get healed. <laughs> Ooh, run away. Axio, get him, Axio. I think we can take him. Uh, Ember, take that. Okay, we'll go down this way, I guess. Um, ooh, enemy gloom, or at least Ember is good against gloom. Oh, don't you make me poison? Ah, oh, made me poisoned again. Rude, really rude. Okay, well, we just have to get down to the next level. There's nothing in this room that we are just in. Ooh, hope we pick the right direction to go in. Yes, okay, we just have to make it to there. Alright, we're on the correct level. We hope we can just find where there. Oh, does that mean somebody's fainted there? Hopefully. Recipe to rescue. Okay, we can do it. Ooh, that's a pip up. Okay, cool. Great job. Would you like to exit the dungeon now? Uh, I guess so. Cool. I think I finally might have done it. <laughs> um, so I guess let's see if uh, what happens afterward. Now continue your adventure. If you're ready to continue with your main adventure, use the southern exit to return to the main menu and select goodbye. Okay. Whew, that would have been embarrassing if <laughs> after all those trials I uh, still wasn't able to save my team. Whew. Really good of them. Um, I guess let's drop off some stuff, huh? Mm, how about all of it? Just drop that off for a later time. And uh, let's deposit all our money also <laughs> for safekeeping. Okay, well, let's return from Pelipper Island. Oh, <laughs> it was just gonna send all of that to my deposit box automatically. Gotcha. Well, good to know. Partially what happens when I don't play this for a while, <laughs> this game. <laughs> I forget stuff like that. Okay, revive. Whew. Basement floor five. Now is it just gonna let me have Pip up? No, it looks like we've got um, Chewy as well as Gumi and um, Esper. We do not have um, Deerling. It looks like still. We almost revive. You can be rescued four more times. Well, I guess that's not too bad. Escape orb. Hmm. Just in case, I guess. Um. Oops, can't go that way. Well. Piplup can, but not the others. Alright. Well, there's an item. Nice. What else do we have? Let's go this way. And if we went up, that's where we came in. So... Oh, look at that! To the next level. But also, I saw this down here. Let's give that to... Chewy. Okay. Are we ready? To basement floor six. I wonder how many levels there are on this. Um, well, I guess since it hasn't said like, oh, your buddies are right there, that uh, we still have a ways to go. Whoop, 
And there's the next level. Ah, run, 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 run. Run quickly. Ah. Quickly. Quickly. It's not letting me. There we go. <laughs> Whew, escaped that one. I don't want to base my floor seven, but I saw that a lot of my guys were getting hungry. Mm, but I don't really have anything to feed them. Sorry about it. Just have to keep going. Um, here it looks like there's an enemy, but also an item. Yes, let's see. Oh, good, it's just a... See that? Okay. Ooh, we got status mirror. Um, makes the Pokemon in front of you have the same bad status. Sure, why not? Um, give it to Esper. Alright, here we go. Uh-oh. Glit. Bubble. Ooh, that's a lot of damage. Nice. Okay. Onward. Nothing in this. I suppose we might as well go around this side before the rest of the map. Hmm. Ooh, an elixir. Looks like there's lots of items and no enemies on this map, so that's good. Okay, and we're basically back where we started, so let's try going back this way. Uh-oh, an enemy. It's a hone edge. Eek. Oh, nice. His high beam got upgraded. Cool. Da da da. Hmm, I think that might just be a cut across. Hmm. And that one might just be going down to where we've already been. Let's try over to the left here. Hmm. And then up, I guess? Hmm. Oops, looks like we're gonna miss a room if we don't go back this way. Come on, guys. Oh, nope, that was not a room. Okay. Well, good to know. Up and around. Ugh, so no... No things in this room either. Ooh, and I only have a belly of 14. Do I have anything that I can eat, like, at all? Uh, an apple, yes! Eat it now! Nice! Okay. Whew. Trying to avoid the mistakes that we made this last go-round. Uh-oh. Spinnerack. Mmm, peck. Uh oh, come on, yes. Um, barrage. Mm, sure, we can have it. Uh oh, ball toy. Bubbles. Oh, good. One of my uh little looper things. Maybe him faint. Try this way. No. Okay, just a connection thing. Gosh, there's so many like connection. Uh pathways instead of, like, actual rooms. It's kind of annoying. Oh, okay, here we go. To the next level! Hurry! <gasps> Ooh, yes, we finally made it! Whew. Looks like a good place to stop and catch our breath. Yeah. Should be safe here for now. Phew, this is chewy. I was so on edge this whole time. <laughs> you and me both, buddy. Now that we've stopped, Suddenly can't stop, seem to stop shaking. Me too, says Kumi. Chewie says, ah, I feel like my vision is going dark. Chewie, stop that this instant. <laughs> Whoa, that was close. Thanks, darling. Esper says, we still haven't seen any sign of Pancham or Shelmet. I suppose the real challenge lies ahead. Everyone, be on your guard. Uh-oh. I guess we... Ooh. I guess we... 
have a little bit of a break, but I don't know, um, if this is, like, right before the boss, or, like, you know, we still have a lot of, uh, um, pl way to go. It's hard to say. Okay, let's get that up, get that up. Have a little reviver seed, and I guess that might help. Okay. Well, uh, we don't really want to leave the dungeon. Um, let's. Well, should we go for it? I guess so, huh? Alright. Basement floor 8. Doesn't look like there's a big boss immediately here. Looks like we're still gonna have to... Um... Oh, look at that! Okay, there's the next level. <laughs> that was pretty easy. We're on basement floor 9. Ugh, I wonder how many. Ooh, look at all these items. Ooh, good job, Chu. Look at all these. Ooh. Good job, team. We're making some quick work of these enemies. Ooh, nice. Okay. So which way to go? I guess straight ahead. That's where a lot of the enemies came from. Ooh. And another very quickly found next level. <laughs> Basement 410. Hopefully I have enough to make it through. This is clairvoyance, holding a looplet with this Emera locates items on the floor. Sure, why not? Give it to Esper, which makes sense. Um, got those. Wands. And here we go. Uh-oh. Enemy. The ball toy. Bubble. Nice. Okay. Uh, whoop, little petrified worm, but nothing else in that. And that was just a pass, pass through passageway type thing. Uh oh, coughing. Nice. Somebody from. Oh, it's a spinner egg. Ooh, pretty strong. Uh oh, uh oh. Uh, let's use mud slap. Take that. Ooh, ooh. That one's kind of a lot of damage. Um, mud slap again. Take that. Okay. Here we go. Uh oh. I guess Chewie's finding somebody? Oh no. Another Honage right from behind. Ooh, ooh. Let's use bubble. Ooh, got some Poke Dollars. Mmm. -hmm. And going to the right would be where we came in on, so time to go this way. Ooh. Mm. Oh, look at that! To the next level! Basement floor 11, wow! Alright. Hmm. Nothing in here. Uh oh, fell them. Mud lap. Uh oh. Gee, that's quite a amount of damage. Woohoo, nice. And we've got toughness. Let's give that to. Uh oh, I guess. Doesn't really... Here, let's replace the clairvoyance one. Okay, uh-oh, uh-oh. There's a ball toy. Oh, did we get it? Nope, not yet. Okay, cool. <laughs> mm. Yep, yeah, nothing over here. Should we keep going over... Oops! <laughs> um, let's 
Can I get him from here with bubbles? Yeah, it looks like I can. Yeah, go, Chewie, go. No. Go away from me. Uh-oh. I'm gonna need to get an apple in a sec. I guess I should do that now, shouldn't I? Um, so we have two fancy apples and a regular one. I guess I'll take the regular one for now. Here we go. Uh, uh oh, spelled them. Eek! Take a mud slap. There we go. Yeah, Chewy, yeah! Oh, killed them back. <laughs> they did themselves with a takedown move. Uh oh. Let. More like I won't let you hurt me that much. <laughs> uh oh, I think this is just a long corridor. Okay, time to go back. Oh, uh, let's. Who's at the end here? Is it Chewy? Can I. Oh, maybe I can't choose who's in charge. Does it have to be me? Okay, I guess it has to be me in charge. Oh well. Oh, maybe that's what that star means. The star means, like, I'm controllable. Oh, yeah. Everybody get that gnome. Here we go. Ah, uh -huh. yes, to the next level. We can do this. We can do it. Lucky number 20. <gasps> Here we go. Chewie says, we've made it pretty far down. I think I hear voices from over that way. Let's go. Dun dun dun! Esper, where were the voices coming from? Is that Chewy? Chewy, is that you? That voice? That's Panchem's voice. Is Scooby missing too? Please, get us out of here. Shelman too. Shelman, Panchem, can you hear us? Where are you two? I'm not really sure. It's all black. Panchem, Shelman, just hold on. We're going to get you out of there. Oh, you will. Dun dun dun. That voice. Who is that? It is I, the Darkland Emissary. What? The Darkland? Uh oh. Oh, it's Kiratina. Yarg. Ah. You have come to a forbidden place. None who have come here have ever returned. What? Oh, poor Chewy. Chewy, don't faint now. <laughs> Steady on. Steady on, mate. However, there is one condition on which I may allow you to depart. Condition? Oh, look, my buddies. Pancham, Shelmet. You guys. Save us. Get us out of here. Here are my conditions. Grant me their spirits, and I swear I'll let you go. What? You heard me. Grant me their spirits. I'll allow you to escape unharmed. Their spirits? What do you say? It's not such a bad deal, wouldn't you say? Not on your life. Chewy! What was that? What, what'd you just say to me? I said that we're not doing that. Oh, cripes, I'm so scared. <laughs> like we'd give them up for ourselves. I think I might faint. Panchen and Shelmanara. It's, it's no good. Our friends, I'm gonna faint. Chewy? Chewy? You, you will come to regret those words. Uh oh. Little Litwick. Poor Litwick. We're surrounded. Everybody, I'm really sorry. You can blame me for all this. No, we feel the same. Even if Chewie hadn't said it, any one of us would have done the same. I'll be brave and fight too, said Gumi. Say farewell to your spirits. I am Giratina, devourer of innocent spirits such as yours. Wah! I am the Darkland Emissary. Uh oh. Ooh. Oh yeah, I forgot that I have that like, thing that like I can do the alliance. Right? Do I do... How do I do the alliance? I forget. Uh. How do I do the alliance? Should I Google this? I should probably Google this. 
how to <laughs> activate alliance. Activate alliance on super mystery dungeon. There we go. How to use an alliance attack. Okay. Um, should be a crest on the touch screen. Uh, need to be right next to an enemy to trigger the alliance prompt. Oh, okay, I guess. So I press R instead. <laughs> oh, okay. I guess I need to be closer to them. At the same time, ah, oh, I didn't mean to push it like that. Uh, uh oh, uh oh. I just meant to face Litwick. Uh, this is not going well. Oh man. Oh man. Oh gosh. Um. Um. Yeah, let's use the alliance. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh man. I don't even. Gosh, there's just so many of them, aren't there? Chewy has grass knot, though, so that's useful. And Gratina is very heavy. Gumi was taking out a Litwick. Um, Esper has one HP. Um, what what have we got going on here? Um, looks like no heal items, but we do have a tiny revive seed. Um, petrify orb petrifies all the enemies in the room. Let's try that. Oh, I guess they have that, like, thing that- <gasps> Oh! We stopped Gratina out of, like, nowhere? Okay. I'll take it. Let's revive Chewy. And do bubble. Mm, bubble again. Mm, this Litwick keeps protecting itself. That's annoying. Bubble! Okay. Ah, let's get this Litwick. Ah, wow, did we do it? Oh, that wasn't too bad, actually. I was expecting it to be much worse. <laughs> but it looks like we've stopped Giratina. Eek, eek. All the Litwick are running away. Chewie says, we did it. We actually beat Giratina. We defeated Giratina. Grr. We won! <laughs> he looks kind of goofy, just kind of like laying on his side, growling. <laughs> we won, said Chewie, so please give Pancham and Shelmet back. I cannot do that. None can leave this place. You know, you keep saying that, but that's not the case. Before we battled, you said you would let us go by exchanging the boy's spirits. If we'd agreed at that time, then we would have been able to return from this place, would we not? <laughs> Uh, I'm a bit confused now, but, 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 uh, I, I'm the Dark Land Emissary, Mir, so please give, give up any hope of returning from this place. Do you even know what you're saying anymore? Sh sh shut up. <laughs> I guess we knocked him cuckoo. Gra. I said you can't, so you can't, got it? Y y you just can't. He's having like a temper tantrum. <laughs> oh, that's enough, Solacis. Ooh. What do we got going on? Litwick. Let's just give it up, Solacis. What? It doesn't look like these kids are going to get scared no, ma no matter what we do. Th then, yeah, it's fine. We're done here. Thanks for trying so hard, though. So I guess it's not actually Giratina. <laughs> but a Solacis. <laughs> yeah, I tried so hard. I really did. <laughs> what? Yeah, Solacis, it's all thanks to you. We could even keep it going this long. We really owe you. So please don't cry. 
please, can you explain what's going on? The truth is, the Garatina that you all fought was not the real Garatina at all. Just an illusion created by Solosis. What? Well, we were just... We're really sorry. Of course, about Giratina being the Dark Land Emissary, me never returning home. It was all just a lie. We're really, really sorry. What? It was all lies. What in the world is going on here? Okay, let me explain. We and Wake are on a journey to try and scare the Pokemon of this world. Seeing others cowering in fear, it's like food to us. What I'm trying to convey is that it's our source of our energy. You get energy from seeing other Pokemon get scared? Yeah, nothing gets us pumped up like seeing somebody trembling in fear. Eek! <laughs> See, just giving your friend Yumi here a little fright made our flame so strong. Whoa! <laughs> so we came here in hopes of scaring everyone, but eventually we always get found out and everyone just ends up getting mad at us. Of course they do. Who wouldn't, said dearly? Then we get chased out of town and have to move on to the next place. That's how we move from one village to the next all this time. But all our usual tricks started to get a bit old. We were just stuck in a rut until we ended up unable to scare anyone at all. And that's when it happened. That's when we met Solosis. Solosis listened to our story, took pity on us in our plight, and eventually even agreed to help us. He can create illusions of frightening Pokemon with his psychic powers. That allows us to scare everyone once again. And boy, do we ever scare everyone. It was just one smash hit after the other. We were just knocking them out of the park, scaring poor villagers left and right. <laughs> they all look pretty proud of themselves. Hey, try not to sound so happy when you're saying that. We made a big mess, and we even had to have sheriffs come to investigate. Esper says, I agree, you've probably taken things too far. Once everyone finds out about this, you probably won't be able to stay here. Well, about that. I feel really bad making any requests after causing such a big fuss, but... Please, do you think you could not tell anyone about us being here, or the way we tried to scare everyone. What? If we get chased out of this village, we'll have to find a new home again. We promise. We won't cause any more trouble, though. Please, we're begging you. Will you agree not to tell the other villagers about what happened here? Sure, says Chewie. What? Hold on, Chewie. Are you sure about this? Are you gonna forgive them? Yeah, I think it's fine. I forgive them. I don't think they're really bad Pokemon. Seems like they feel bad about it all. And Litwick have to scare Pokemon to get energy, right? So, I mean, this time they went too far and that's no good, but maybe it's okay if it's just a little, a reasonable amount of scaring them. Oh, and they should try to do something good for every time they scare somebody. On the sly, so no one notices. Wait, how come you're deciding everything? What does everyone else think? To be honest, I have a hard time following Chewie's thinking. <laughs> Saying it's fine to scare Pokemon just a little? How do you measure that? But I do think doing something nice for others is a good idea. So, if that's what Chewie wants, then I suppose I'm alright with it. Esper. I, I think it's okay to go along with Chewie's idea, too. I mean, I guess. It's pretty strange, but I think it might end up alright. Gumi. But, Tina, what do you think? You think we should forgive Litwick, like Chewie says? I know that Litwick aren't really cruel Pokemon, so I guess it's alright, as long as they realize what they did was wrong. Tina, yeah. If Chewie wants to forgive them, then I guess we've got to. After all, Chewie was the one who was most scared by all this. Dearly. But you didn't have to remind everyone I was most scared. So I guess it's so I guess we are decided. We won't tell anyone about the Litwick. Really? Thank you. Thank you so much. Don't forget to do nice things for others either. Of course, we won't forget. We'll be sure to do good things. We won't let anyone know either. No more big pranks like this one. Is that a deal? Even if Mr. Farfetch'd was a harm, 
I'm still not right to go kidnapping Pokemon. Wouldn't that be Pokenapping? Oh, speaking of kidnapping. Oh yeah, what about Panchan and Shelmet? <laughs> oh yeah. Solicis, if you would. Yeah. Whoop. Yay, our buddies. Panchan and Shelmet. <laughs> Aw. You guys, where? They were so scary. Thank goodness they both are okay. Come on, it's time we all headed home. And so, the children wrapped up their adventure, having proved their mettle. Each returned to his or her own home, safe and sound. They slipped in quietly, so none of the adults would notice. Oh yeah, I forgot they were all like doing this in the middle of the night. Except for Chewie and Dina. Oopsies. Costa says, You, you little fools. <laughs> what do you think you're doing, running around in the middle of the night? And sneaking out to do so without a lick of permission from us. Nosleaf says, Well now, I don't know if it's all so bad as they say. What are you saying? You're far too lenient on these kids. When a child steps out of line, a scolding is what you use to get them back in line. Now, step up to the task. Uh, Pops, I'm really sorry, said Chewy. I don't know, maybe it's all the nerves, but I'm suddenly bushed. So... I'm going to bed. <laughs> Good night. Oh, oh, Chewie fell asleep like right there. Now, just a minute, Chewie. We're not done talking about this. Wake yourself up right this minute. <laughs> oh, give me any time to pass out. That's how you're gonna play it? Then Dina, I guess you alone get the pleasure of being lectured by me. <laughs> what? Hope you're ready. Ooh because you inconsiderate little rascals meow 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 anyone with a common amount an ounce of common sense would meow 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 gripe 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 nag 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 gripe and so Dina ended up on the receiving end of one of Caracosta's infamous lectures unable to escape until nearly dawn and all in Chewie's place jeez so would you like to save your adventure? yes save do not turn off the power. Oh, it looks like now we have the fourth official boss badge thing. Woo, we're halfway through. Save completed. You've had a great adventure today. You should rest before you play some more. I agree, and I'm very glad we got past this dungeon and can finally move on to something else. But that's gonna have to wait till the next episode. So, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye!